going nowhere without this. Where would you mugspouts even be without me? What is it you expect to need Kratos for, Highness? Clearly you've been quite capable of breaking Odin's curses on your own. The other curses grew weak from Thimble Winter, but I still needed help to break them. This one is held strong. So all that trying to kill him, that's just your goddessy way of asking for help? I don't recall asking you to come along. It's because you didn't. I got an old drinking buddy I've been meaning to look up once this joint were back on the map. Got a hunch lending you mokes a hand's gonna end me up where I'm going. And what makes you think that? Cause last I heard tell, she was running with that beef wet brother of yours. Freyr... ...is not a part of this. Well, my <laughs> hunch says otherwise. <laughs> Throat, too. <laughs> the pool of the binding curse its source is further in follow me muggier than a moonful hind shit pit out here and nearly as fragrant suppose thimble winter's to blame but if it helps these two find Go! peace this is a temporary alliance Mimi. anything beyond that would require trust oh please you know damn well kratos isn't the true cause of your suffering you're both as much a part of my suffering as anyone Come on, let's find a way forward. Huh? Through here. Oh no. Something's wrong. My spell, I can feel it slipping. Well, that's Thimble Winter for you. You don't understand. I'll be torn from the realm. What can be done? Something I was hoping to avoid. Seems I don't have much choice. Falky! <sighs> Come on, then. You had a way of <gasps> Odin's curse this whole time. No. I discovered it once you unlocked realm travel. And it solves very little. This form is extremely limiting. Hey, uh, how's about a riddle to take your mind off? What no runs way. with no legs? Easy, a nose. You'll have to try harder than that, Brock. Just you wait, smart guy. Watch where you're going. The plants are extra <laughs> aggressive in this humidity. <laughs> I recognize this market. Villages would meet and trade here. Why'd they never rebuild? Brother, do you really think she'll let us off the hook if you help her? I do not know. I choose to help. After that, we will see. Looks like they sure left behind a lot of goodies. Shame to let them collect dust. That's one way of looking at it.
is close. Forgot how much I like scrapping dirty. Boy, you don't... Where has everyone gone, I wonder? They must have withdrawn. Hidden themselves out in the wilds and covered their tracks with magic. No way of knowing how many are left or how to reach them. Aesir ran hot shot all over this place. You can thank Mimir for that. War with the Vanir was never my idea. My idea was brokering the marriage to end it. A great success that was. Obviously, the peace was no less a disaster than the marriage. Did he invade again as soon as I was exiled? <laughs> Not now, brother. We've got company. One of them And you want to keep your insides inside. Yeah. All yours. Yeah. Your people not receiving visitors? I wouldn't know. They're not my people anymore. Yeah. Come on up. Bet you're glad old Brock's around to save your skin. Uh-oh. Shit! Yeah! We should probably go get him. Keep your guard up. Send another god to do his dirty work. Thor too busy. We do not serve Odin. <laughs> no? Picked a dangerous place for sightseeing then. All right. No, no. No need for threats, brother. Oh, I know that voice. <laughs> you know, I'd cut off your head, but it seems somebody beat me to it. Aye, oh, quite observant, brother. <laughs> no, you're no brother of mine. 
You sold my sister to that prick. We broke it a piece. Oh. Did you now? Where is it? Hmm? And where is my sister? Some dungeon in Asgard? Is she even alive? Answer me. I guess we'll settle for blood. Stop! What is that? Why do you speak in her voice? It's me, Yngwie. There's no time to explain, just listen. These men are in my service. I'm here to reclaim what's been taken from me. It's too late. You can't undo what's been done. I can. I will. Now let them pass. So... You serve my sister. Put him down. What's with leaving me hanging like that, you crusty hag? Oh, can it, Blobber? Come here. Well, found who I was looking for. Think I'm gonna stay and catch up. Oh, are you now? Do as you wish. Brother, if you wouldn't mind, I'd have a word with Lord Freya. Sorry we got off on the wrong foot there, stranger. I'm pretty used to only seeing Aesir in these parts. I typically get friendly faces. That... That is a friendly face. Right? His name is Kratos, and no. The Aesir are in Vanaheim. <laughs> yeah, we've been occupied since... Yeah, I lost count. What is your plan? I'm still kind of working on it. Mm-hmm. Brother, I think I could be of use here. If my counsel is welcome. Well, I'll take what I can get. Your mission will go considerably smoother without me in the mix. Come back for me when you're done. So don't tell me! Oh, okay, well, well, then you can help me at the forge while you spill everything. Hey, Kratos. As long as you're working. Trying to play on my sympathies in the hope I let you live. I am only trying to help. The mistakes of the past need not be repeated. I don't need to hear about your mistakes. I've made enough of my own, thanks. We need to get to that watchtower. We'll have to go through the valley, this way. I know your son's story. You should know my daughter's. In the service of a cruel god, I was tricked into destroying a village, not knowing my own wife and child were there until their blood stained my hands. I swore revenge. That's... I can't imagine. I paid back their blood a thousand times and burned Olympus to the ground. Yet, the guilt 
slain. Perhaps you will kill me, Freya. But it will bring you no peace. Perhaps it is not peace I seek. All those times I found you. Why'd you refuse to fight me? Every outcome would mean defeat. What does that mean? I have never wished you harm, Freya. You helped us. You saved Atreus when he was sick. I did not wish to live with killing you any more than I wished to die. I see. No, sir! They will not let you pass unless you destroy them all! Seek with Freyr in the crawl. We'd spend afternoons stealing honey bread from the Grand Hall. At harvest time, we'd dance and feast until the sun rose. It's all so simple. Why did I have to be reminded of all this?
May Freya never waver. The other half is missing. May she protect us. An old adage of the road. I hear them inside. Get ready to clear them out. Enough what Odin did to me. He's desecrated every memory I have of home. Be glad you have a home to remember fondly. In Sparta, we were taken from our homes as children and raised in the Agoji. We marched though we drowned, fought for scraps or starved. Our elders beat us till we could not stand. At night, we made our way home, alone, or were food for wolves. Is how Spartans are made. These plants behave similarly to the scorn holes we found in the foothills of Midgard ages ago. Well, considering how Spartans are made, it's no wonder you turned out as you did. Your fate was sealed from the start. Fate can be overcome. I used to think so. When the Norns told me of my son's fate, I thought I could change it. You know well how that worked out. The Norns. The fates of these lands. That's right. You defy prophecy at your own peril. <laughs> Atreus would agree with you about prophecy. He rushes blindly to a fate the giants foretold. He disappears for two days, trying to prove he is their champion, fabled to fight in Ragnarok. What? I know all the Ragnarok prophecies. There's no champion of the giants. It is one glow concealed. Because of this champion, the realms are saved at Ragnarok. Only Asgard falls, and Odin with it. So all this time... Odin's obsession with the detail of Ragnarok, he's been missing a crucial piece. Huh. Well done. Atreus will not be a pawn of prophecy. You still stand against fate, even with victory foretold. I will not march my son to war. 
He is no Spartan. I would keep it that way. You would speak to me of protecting your child? Is my tragedy not enough of a lesson? <laughs> Fighting fate is a waste of the precious time we're given to spend with them. You never know when someone will come along and cut it short. That's one of Odin's captains. Be ready. <laughs> from you today. Can you please just shut up? Do not tell me to kill again. What? I killed to protect my son, to aid my friends. But I will be no one's monster. Never again. You don't get to make that choice. Not with the debt you owe me. I am not here for debts. I would always have helped you. So much has been taken from me and I'm just supposed to let it all go? Freya. Enough. Feel the source of the magic keeping me in Midgard. What is this place? My home. I was born here. Hmm. Hold on. Something's not right. Opin Bera. Hmm. World tree roots bound in Odin's damn knots. That's how he did it. Come on! Nico! Richard! It belongs to Odin? No! It protects the Israel's boots, wherever they are. Master was counting on it. <laughs> I need to get to those roots. Drag it out. Don't let it hide in the realm tear. Still in the way! I need 
to get to those roots! I know! Let 
done. It's over. It's, it's really over. And now that you have what you seek, I suppose this is the point where I forgive you, where I kill you. Have you decided? I can do either. There's still a part of me that is so angry. And it'll always be. It'll always be angry. But no. You are not the one who needs to die. I do see that. Look. Everything that's happened between us. No need to explain. Not to me. Not for that. I do not regret saving your life. And never will. But the choice between life and death should have been yours to make. I should not have robbed you of that choice. It's time to face my brother. And after that? I don't know. It's been a long time since I've had a choice. Let me live with that for a moment. We can take this way back to the camp. I can help with the vines. Now embed your blades into the glowing... Fast learner. Your brother seemed open to your return. Oh, I'm sure he'd love nothing more than for everything to pass Leaving the responsibilities of leadership to me. <clears throat> 